I am Oliver Green, and I am half of the group for change, and I'm bringing you, that's right, you, another edition of the 100-Day Video Challenge, day 66. And it's this decade challenge we're talking about. And it's this decade challenge we're talking about. Is it just me, or... Can you attest to, you didn't think you would be where you are today, 10 years ago. I didn't think I was going to be where I am today, last year, because I didn't know. But I also didn't have a plan in place as to specifically where I wanted to be. If somebody would have told me 10 years ago that I'd be a substitute teacher, I probably would have laughed at him. If you would have told me a year ago that I would have been a substitute teacher, I probably would have laughed at you. But I sit in this classroom and all I can do is I laugh at myself because some of the kids that I see in third, fourth, fifth grade, that used to be me. It used to be me. And I went to private school. I went to Catholic school. And I spent a lot of time at the nun's desk because I'd like to talk. I might admit to being somewhat disrespectful because I didn't want to listen to what they had to say. But the one thing that I can remember, I never had anybody to forecast to me where they thought I might be in however many years. Now, you do have people that will look at you and base your future on your parents' past. Because your parents didn't do to them means you're not going to do either. Well, my parents aren't me. And although I may have done some of the same things that my dad has done, doesn't mean that I can't change the future. The only way to change the future, the only way to make a difference is to see myself 10 years from now. What does the however old I'll be, look like in 2029. And it's a scary thought because there's so many things that I want to do and I don't know how to get them all done. That's how I used to think. Forward thinking has allowed me to open my mind and dream it. But a dream is nothing but a thought if you don't put any action behind it. So in 2029, I need to look, I need to figure out where I want to be and then I have to work backwards. And if that mean, means I need to break it down in quarters or it, however, but if I don't have the goal, if I don't see the big picture, then I'll never be able to put something, a plan, a system in place to get there. I will always be wanting to know. I will always be wishing. I will always wonder what if. I need for you, and Oliver is talking to Oliver as well, to sit down and get out of your head your wildest, craziest dream. And then figure out how to get there. It may mean that some of the things that you're doing now, you can't. It may mean that you have to put a very strict plan in place to make sure that you obtain it, but you have to be disciplined. 
It may mean that you have to inquire the services of some individuals to hold you accountable because you can't do it by yourself. But if you don't plan for it, it won't happen. If you don't have a detailed plan as to uh, what it is that you want to obtain <laughs> at the end of the week, it won't happen. If you didn't take heed to Black Friday last year, realizing that you didn't have enough money and that you were robbing Peter to pay Paul or that you didn't make your car note payment because you wanted to buy a new TV. I saw something today on, uh, I think it was Facebook. Every year people get a new television. But what happened to the television that you had last year? Every year you see people. It might not be the same people. But people getting TVs. I wonder if some of those people in line are the same people that got were in line getting TVs last year. If you didn't take heed that you needed to start saving your money last year for this year, you're in the same boat as you were last year, November 26, 2018. Trying to figure out how you're going to get 13 gifts with $6. I need for you to plan differently. I need for you to plan accordingly for your goal. I need for you to write your goal down. If you don't write your goal down, you can't plan for it because it's just a thought in your head. I am Oliver Green. I am half of a group for change and I'm bringing you, that's right, you, another edition of the 100 Day Video Challenge, Day 66.